Yeah. I mean, I think for us, the, the reason is, is talent, right? So there's a couple of places you can go and do, and we do very hard code, 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 hard code robotics stuff, right? It's not easy, and so you have Massachusetts as a real hub of a lot of great universities, and we steal a lot of people from WPI every year. Um, and uh, we don't really steal them, we pay them a lot of money, just to be clear. <laughs> and the other place, I guess, would be the West Coast. And, and I think for us, um, I, I will just say the, um, I, I think the talent pool and the environment out here is more conducive, I think, to long-term growth. I think there's too many people, in my opinion, on the West Coast ch chasing the IPO or the unicorn and, and not trying to really be a sustainable kind of company. And so I think the business environment here is better um, and kind of the reason that we're in Wilmington, uh, it comes to this, whatever, 35 mile radius. For us, it's a good talent pool. I think we can pull the younger demographics um, out of Boston, and then we have the older demographics that is too expensive to live in Massachusetts, so they go up in, in New Hampshire, so we have a lot of people that commute uh, from southern New Hampshire in, into Wilmington. So for us, it was a kind of a good, um, location to have a, a kind of a talent pool that made sense. It is, it is. Yeah. So I think that the right answer is we are there and here. So I think that as, as a new company or new kid on the block, I don't see myself from Barcelona, Boston, or anywhere. I want to be here in the United States. I want to be in Europe, and I want to be in Asia. And that is the way it should be. We are selling these devices that you have seen worldwide in Asia, US, and Europe in more than 40 countries. Um, I do think founders like me, we need to move according to our markets. So for example, our market in Europe is very stable. We manufacture there. So I think it's an example when people talk about startups, I mean, maybe it's a classy name, but we are doing what you guys are doing. We are building physical hardware devices and we are putting software on top and we are trying to bring a lot of science to be competitive. I don't want anybody from Asia to copy my device. I want to have the knowledge and the barriers of entry around how does the brain work? How do you model the brain? How do you understand what's going on in the brain? How do you inject currents into the brain? That knowledge is something that it's very hard to get and that is why Boston is a brilliant place. Uh, we found that coming to the US we work with some of the best brain researchers in the world. And I think that Massachusetts should credit the capacity to attract the best talent um, in the world. So I think that companies, and you know, I don't know if unicorns or not, but you know, I'm selling, I have a production facility, I have Salesforce, you know, and, and you can say I'm a unicorn. No, I'm a normal company, you know, doing something innovative in healthcare. Um, but I think that we have to follow where the talent is, and nobody can deny that in life sciences, um, the center of the world is here. 